From the beginning, we really have focused on education and outreach. We've been really thankful for our local help in arranging school visits. Uh, we've had the ASI group out to many local schools and bring instrumentation directly to schools where we've had hundreds of students. We have started working with the schools, teaching the schools what Relampago is, but also teaching them that they can participate in that. And we told them that actually all of them were science. They can help taking pictures of hail, taking videos of floods. They can measure precipitation also. Our first full day here, we went to Cordoba and got to discuss the weather with a bunch of local students. I like to ask them about hail, what kind of hail that they see fall from the sky. And, you know, they hold up their hands like hail falls this big. And to them, it's, it's just what happens. They use the word piedra to describe hail. And what that means is rock. So it, they, they literally describe it as rock falling from the sky. It was really exciting just to see how excited they were to learn about science and to just share with them our passions. Getting to know, like, see the culture of this country as well through going to the schools and meeting with the locals has been really cool. They put on a dance for us and then they had us come out and dance also, so a folk dance. To be able to interact with everyone and to be able to represent the entire project was really amazing. We've had s several people stop. And they are just really friendly. They're very excited. They're enthusiastic. The kids' eyes light up. Uh, and uh, so I think we're making a pretty good inreach there uh, for, the, for the people here in, in Argentina. The students are really excited to learn about the storms that they experience every day. And hopefully we can provide some basic understanding and maybe even some motivation for them to pursue studies in the geosciences.